This is an antique tricycle from the 1800s. Um, dates to around 1884 or 5, I believe, is the date underneath the seat. Um, I'll look there now, actually. If you look underneath, I think it's got it's got a date right there that says 18. 81 at least is could be the patent date perhaps but so the wood on the seat I believe is is original you can see some, a lot of the hardware has been replaced um, that was done during a, a restoration so it's, it's not all original because some of the hardware has been replaced in the cloth I believe the original horse hair is in there in the seat. But you can see these springs on the seat. One, two, two, three, four. And my intent with this video is is to show it in detail because I am putting it on eBay. So it's mostly just gonna be me walking around around it with my video camera you can see here this is the, the seat and the seat back this cloth had been replaced it's not original you can see it, it almost looks like there is some type of vine pattern perhaps here and there I'm not sure if that was original or not let's look at the top now this is the top this top had all been restored with new cloth new plywood um, Unfortunately, they had stapled some Velcro up top. There are four pieces of Velcro um, because they had an advertisement on this. Um, this was used in parades throughout New Hampshire, actually, uh, for advertising. So there was an advertising banner that was on there as the person would pedal it in the parades. You can see the plywood is new. They're fairly new anyway. It certainly doesn't date back to the 1880s. I believe the canopy hardware is original. I mean, the this iron piece that goes up the frame anyway. And this will actually just pull out. You can see um, it's just it'll just slide right there and actually pull right off if you don't want it. but the seat I believe is original just the uh, the wood not the cloth and it appears to still have horse hair in it again the hardware is not all gonna be original but um, the spokes some of them, I'm told, were restored and straightened out. Let's show you the... Um, it does roll pretty nicely. You can see it goes up and down as you pedal it. I don't have a lot of room here to, to demonstrate. But uh, let's do a close-up of this wheel. I'm not sure. I don't know a whole lot about bikes in general, so I'm just doing my best to show you here the I think this I don't know. I really don't know if that would have been something they restored um, or not. The, the tires that is here again. This might have just been like a magic marker. This fine pattern and perhaps that's what they, 
they were trying to do up here. I, I don't know if that was original or not. Um, but whoever restored it perhaps did that. So you can see I just got some patina and racing stripes that go all the way back. And both have pedals that move. There's like a little cotter pin or something right in here. For the front wheel. And there's this wheel. You can see how nice the spokes are on it. Again, I think some of them were restored or replaced, perhaps. There's the handle. Another view of the top. And a look at this wheel here. And the spokes. Look at that wheel. So, I don't know, that's basically it. Um, feel free to let me know if you have any questions about it. There's a screw hole right here. Again, that may, you may, maybe this should be supposed to be pinned or something so that it doesn't, so that you can't pull it out. There's also a matching hole here. So. Again, I don't really know a whole lot about this bike. I just thought it was kind of cool. And when I saw it, I decided to buy it. going on eBay so I'm just taking a detailed video to show the condition again that cloth has been replaced I think whoever restored it did a nice job on it that's an older restoration I'd say probably 20 years or so old but there it is Show this rail too. Some of the some of this uh, racing stripe stuff is coming off. But anyway, there it is.